Hi, I'm Penny Clark and this is the home of the British Sailing Team TV channel. This evening I've got with me uh, double Olympic gold medalist Ian Percy. Um, Ian, this is your fourth Olympic Games, uh, but home games, very different, very special. Are you getting the chance to actually enjoy it and soak up the atmosphere? Um, I don't know if I am yet. We're very lucky this year that we finish in the first week, so we'll be able to enjoy it after the event. At the moment, we're just thinking about the next race and you know that kind of boring stuff, just working away at it all. And Friday, uh, last Friday night, obviously got presented on Weymouth Beach to, to the huge crowds in the public. What was that like, seeing all those people that turned up? Yeah, it's amazing. Yeah, the first thing I thought when I was there, wow. And then you, you have to thank the guys for coming down and giving that support. It's very different. You know, we're just not used to that as sailors travelling the world. And suddenly you you feel the passion of the home crowds. Amazing. Um, but it, it, I probably don't need any more inspiration to keep hiking. But if, if I needed it, it's there. Hey, dig me. Hey, mate. And, uh, and, you know, you've already said, you know, heads down, doing the hard work, getting the job done. Um, but how do you relax? What do you do in the evenings? Uh, well, I mean, to be honest, it's quite busy and quite late into the night because we have to work on the strategy for the next day and warm down. And um, But tonight's a bit different. We've got a lay day tomorrow, so we'll be able to relax tonight and get a good night's sleep and get back into it probably tomorrow evening again. So probably 24 hours to unwind. And uh, two of the front cyclists, they go cycling on their day off. What have you got planned? No, not that. Uh, no, the starboat struggles enough in strong winds and 25, 30 knots forecast tomorrow. We'll, we'll just keep the, keep the rig in the boat and <laughs> check it all out and, and hope it's, and get it all ready for the next day. And uh, you've come through the OA youth system. As I said, you know, fourth Olympic Games. You got any advice for any young sailors out there who want to get involved and, uh, and move on to the Olympics? Um, advice, I just think that um, certainly the results in youth level aren't that important. It's about uh, the weight and all the rest of it makes so much difference. So keep plugging away and, and, and working at it. That's the main thing and enjoying it too. So, you know, have fun with the guys around you at your club, in the area and just see where it takes you and don't put too much pressure on yourself at a young age. And to any of our club sailors who are watching, if you were to give them one tip to improve their racing, what would it be? Oh. Go on the tack that takes you closest to the windward mark off the start. Brilliant. Thank you very much, Cheers. Ian.